What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Tony D. Two Wild checking in once again back with another episode of God Merly. Today with a very special edition of that with the Nike Air Force One Nocta Drake certified. Damn it, I did it wrong. Lover boy. <laughs> Guys, we have our hands on the Nike Air Force One Drake Certified Lover Boy, and supposedly these are set to release sometime in December. And it's it's been pushed back for over a year. You know, it was supposed to be uh, releasing back then when the actual album released. We have here though the Nike Air Force One box that it comes in with the "Love You Forever" in that gold, and it says Air Force One Low SP White White White, and this is a six wide. This is not my size, but don't worry, we will definitely get my size in the near future. In association with Nocta, which is also featured here and also featured on this shoe as well. When you open up that box, you got some paper with the Nike Air and that Nocta logo going on. Real simple simple dimple on the material right there. And these things are releasing, are re retailing for $160. That's insane. Bam! Check them out, man. Look, let's be honest. You don't get really much anything different in this shoe compared to any other Air Force One out there on the market, especially now with all the custom or the premium material leathers that Nike has been doing on the Air Force One. But with this one in particular, you get a Nike Air Force One with the Love You Forever on the side. On the other side, you also have this, the regular Air that's popped up there, and you have the Nocta logo on the back. Now, this is the left shoe. On the inside, you have Nike and Nocta on the insole. But on this shoe right here, you have the Nike Air Force One logo on the back. Make sure it's low, yeah, there you go. But you do have the Love You Forever there as well and the Air right there. So check them out. I'm gonna be honest though, the quality of the leather is very, very nice. It's a very nice tumbled granddaddy nutsack leather material being used on this shoe and you know, specifically on the upper. But it does feel like a lot of the recent Air Force Ones that have been coming out with that premium material. Especially from Soul Play, I've been getting and seeing tons of Air Force Ones that they've been getting in that all feature this same exact type of leather that retail for around 100 to $120. So you're getting, you know, that, but you're paying for the Drake name along with it. On the insole, you do have that all leather insole, like the in, the in, not insole, but the inner lining of the shoe has that same leather going on, but it's more of a smooth leather than a more rough. On the back of the tongue, you also have that same exact leather going on. And we'll definitely be doing a follow-up with the full in-depth review on this shoe as it gets closer and closer to the actual release date. But I did want to show what I can at that moment. You got the ABC beads going on, which are going to be pretty dope and nice. People can, you know, throw these on throughout the laces to kind of do their own little customization. And it seems like it has every single letter in the alphabet and every single number from zero to nine. So it doesn't seem like there's anything doubled up. I don't know if it says like certified lover boy maybe because not nah, certified lover boy. There's no U in that. There's no X in that. So I see like all the letters, pretty much ABC all the way to zero nine through the beat. So you can kind of figure out what you want to do. I feel like they should have doubled it up. There should be like two A's for each set of lace, you know, if you want to do something, but you better figure out what you can do so you can throw them in the laces on each side and uh, do your thug thizzle, you feel me? Extra set of laces. These are more of a premium set of laces that are used on this one. And I'm guessing the reason why they made these extra set, they're also white. Same as this one. These come with white laces with a regular disc tip. This one has a metal tip on the end that's thicker. And I guess that's so if you end up putting the beads on anywhere throughout the shoe, these will not come off because these little tips are screwed on. It seems like they're screwed on on the top so that they won't, you know, the beads won't come out. So very cool, very thoughtful design on that aspect as well. You have the Air Force One with that metallic shine right there in the building. So make sure you guys keep that in mind too, that shine one more time, you feel me? Real nice overall look, real good material, but that $160 price point is definitely a hmm for me. I'll be honest though, Nikki, she wants a pair of these. Nikki wants this shoe. She's been asking about this shoe. So she probably will end up, if I can get my hands on her size, be having this, but for me personally, it's gonna possibly be a pass, so it is what it is. So yeah, keep it going there. But yeah, guys, let me know you guys' thoughts and opinions down below in the comment section. Make sure you guys go follow me over on my secondary channel, Too Wild for TV. Also go follow me over on my Twitch. We do a lot of gaming on there. Tony D Too Wild. All the links will be down below in the description. Sign up for whatnot and much, much more. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all, and I'm gonna see y'all in the next one. 
It's your boy, Tony D2Wild. I'm checking in. I'm checking out. Peace.